Hi y'all, Recycling Mama D here. So, I uh, was going through a jewelry box, and it was my grandmother's jewelry box. Um, and I wanted to show you what I found. I haven't opened up everything, but uh, I did lay it all out and try to pair things if they had pairs. So, I'm going to flip you around, and... Uh, we're going to look together. So here is the jewelry box. And it does have some staining in it. But it's still, it is clean. Even though, you know, it's just old. I mean, it's older than I am. And if I haven't said it before, I'm 53 at this point in time. And today is October 25th. Of course, this won't come out and probably until the beginning of <clears throat> when y'all see it won't come out until the first week of November but this right here I thought was really cool uh, I've already tested it to see if it was stainless steel you know um, it is not it's not magnetized at all show you this is a super magnet in case Y'all are wondering because it has Joann's. And those of you who don't know, Joann's is a fabric store. Wonderful place if you're a sewer in, on the West Coast. Anyway, so like I was saying, this right here, it is a souvenir of Colorado. <laughs> but here's the funny part. When you flip it over, it says, Made in Japan. <laughs> but it's a souvenir from Colorado. Anyway, that's funny. So here we have some tie tacks. Uh, the little plastic gems oh, fell off. There's only one. So these will go into the little collection here. I sell these as a, a, a lot for people who like to craft with them. Here's a... Uh, an earring, only one, and a little clasp for a necklace, and it will go in there as well. Um, I think this is an opal, an uncut opal, or maybe it's a fossil. Uh, I don't know, but I'm going to keep it until I find out for sure. Here's another piece of an earring. At one time, same with this. So they will all go back here. Here is a bug. Is this not cute? It is a brooch, but the piece is broke on it. So I'm going to put it in the bundle type thing. Uh, here is one clip vintage earring. I mean, this is all, ooh, yuck. <clears throat> the padding on it is uh, disintegrating. So that's going to be cleaned up before I put it in the little thing. You have to excuse my mess here. I take pictures and all kinds of stuff and I'm waiting on my light to come back because my daughter used it too finished up the pumpkin um here is this is my middle name actually ouch so uh i don't know if i'm gonna keep it or not i might i might just put it out there it says francis and those of you don't know if you're a woman and your name is francis at the end is es if you're a boy it's is isn't that cool but this was probably my um, grandmother's sister. She died on the operating table from open heart surgery. I was named after her. So here's some more um, gems, plastic backings, and whatnot here. I'll put those in there as well. 
There is another little pearl charm. Um, I don't think it's gold. Let's see. Well, it doesn't stick, so I don't know. Maybe I'll check it before I put it in there. There's a screw. I'm not going to put that in there. <clears throat> then we have this earring. I was really hoping to find this earring because this, to me, is just as cute. Even though it's a screw back, I think it's very, very pretty. Simple, yet a little flashy, you know? But, alas... It's going to go in the box. Uh, here's a, a vintage safety pin. Put it in there for now. This is a uh, part of a... Uh, oh, here it is. A fly. And for those of you who don't know, that's for fishing. I'm going to put those in there as well. Um, let's see, this is gold, this is gold, sorry, I'm not, this is, uh, an old vintage, um, earring, but, well, it might not be, like, vintage, vintage, like, grandma era, vintage, uh, that would be antique, Donna, not vintage. Uh, it's not antique because it's post, but um, as you can see, it's bent. But I'm going. There's only one, so it's going to go in the box as well. Um, so this is going to go in the gold pile. There's another safety pin. Here is another earring, which is very cute. It's brown. And come on. Start trying to focus on everything in the back. See, it's a little dangly ball. Isn't that cute? Anyway. Um, these are actually my mom's. They do not have um, the backs to them. Maybe one of those backs belonged to them, but I don't know. These as well were my mother's. I'm going to have them tested to see if they're real. Um, I don't think they are, but I don't remember. I just remember her wearing them. These are real. Um, and then these as well were my mom's. I don't understand why they were in my grandmother's unless she just... My grandmother had uh, dementia a bit... So, <clears throat> here's some hoops. Um, these do not look real. But I will look to see if I can find anything on them that could possibly. And then this right here. Um, little roses set in um I want to say maybe like it's what they call lucite. Um, it definitely needs to be polished up because it's, you know, old. But it's very pretty still. I remember my grandmother wearing this. I used to love watching her um, put wear it, which wasn't often. And then there's some hangly, dangly... Um, for earrings. These I'm going to put, well, I need to see if they're real gold, because if they're real gold, I'll put them in the gold pile bag. Then we have a little cross here, and this looks like it's probably a pendant, or maybe not a pendant, earrings. Uh, that might be silver, so I'll have to check that out. And then these are interesting. I remember my mom had these. They go to a pair of earrings, which I have not found yet. Uh, they're backs. And 
you add them to, I don't know, it, let's just uh, say if you wanted, those wouldn't really work. Say if this was an earring here, okay, and you wanted to make it a little different, you know, spice it up a little more. You would put this on the back, and I can't show you because I only have one hand. And it would dangle. There we go. See? And uh, you would actually have two earrings in one. So, you could wear them simplified, or you could wear them with a little more. Um, here are some more earrings. They are a pair, but these are definitely not real because they are tarnishing, but they're not, you know, anything special. They, um, see, they've got the green yuck <laughs> that grows on non-real stuff. And then here we have another earring. It's a hoop back, and it is also only one. So, there we go. Um... going to get this off the table. This table was my grandmother's. The one that everything's sitting on. And this this is my hair. When I was a little girl I had my hair cut for my aunt's wedding who was my mom's twin. Um, and I had ringlet curls. You can see a little bit of the ringlet. But Yep, there's that. And then um, this here is, uh, I thought it was uh, one of those bracelets for um, when you're allergic to something, but it is not. And it says, School of Mines, Colorado. There's nothing on the back. Um, it's not me metallic or anything. So I need to check into that. Oh, and I forgot this right here. Christmas. Um, there are no... Oh, there is a marking. Okay, now I have to see if I can read it. While it's not focusing, it's probably a Monet, to be honest. This looks like... Oh, my goodness. Alright, I will update when the video comes out. I'll let you know. <clears throat> um... I put my granny glasses back on. Y'all can't see, but I've got granny glasses on. This right here was my grandmother's watch. She wore it all the time, all the time. It's a Timex. And beautiful. Um I don't know if it's real gold or not. I mean, it's not tarnished none. Um, let me see. If it will wind. Yeah, it's not stiff or anything. I moved. You can move the hands. Sorry, y'all. I'm trying to see if I can't wind it and if it works because if it works 
No, maybe it's battery operated. I don't remember. I really don't. Uh, she was, my grandmother was uh, the one who bought my first watch, and of course it was Atomics. And this was my mother's. Uh, it's a mother of pearl shell. And um, my mom's name was Thea. Well, it wasn't Thea. It was short. Thea was short for her name. And, um, yeah. And this is old. It's a, ouch. <laughs> it's a brooch. And it's sharp. It's a little bent, but, you know. Who wouldn't be bent if you were at least 53 years old? And I'm sure it was a lot older than 53. Then we have these. School of Mines, Colorado. And these flip up. So they definitely hold on to clothing because they have the little... So I'm definitely going to have to check into those. And there's two of those. And they both. They both come up. I'm not going to ruin my nails for that. Um, let's see. We have this. I don't know. It looks like an eagle. Don't hold me to it. Because I don't know. And this is probably a pin that you have to... Yeah, pull apart, and I cannot, you cannot do that one-handed. Here is another brooch with a mother-of-pearl background. It needs to be cleaned up. And you open it up. Then you can put your pictures in. And it looks like it still has the parts that pop out to hold the pictures in. The little discolored framing on the inside. Um, it says gold filled. JWN Company. Don't know what it's saying and it says in the middle. Unfortunately. But yeah, these things pop out, and you can also you use them to trace around your picture as your uh, pattern. Um, and then this is supposed to clasp, it's supposed to catch. Hmm. I mean, it's old. Maybe it just needs to be. Refixed. <clears throat> Refixed. But yeah, that's what we have. Um, oh, no. My bad. My bad. We got one more thing. Let me pause and put you down so, so I can open this bag. Okay. So, I've got the bag open now. Oh. Okay. So, that is a piece of... A little piece of tiger eye... I love Tiger Eye. And then this. It's either Jade or Bloodstone, I'm going to guess. Probably Jade. Or Dark Jade. But I can't really tell. Just guessing. We have a butterfly, and those of you who've watched my channel, I probably have said it, my grandmother loved, loved, loved butterflies. She was obsessed with butterflies like I am obsessed with owls. <clears throat> so there's no marking on the 
butterfly itself. Doesn't seem to be any markings on the... Oh, it's definitely not real. <laughs> Actually startled me because I wasn't expecting it before it even got there. It was like... Bloop. See? <laughs> it is very, very metal. Um, let's see about the... Yeah, the, the butterfly as well. So. <clears throat> that will... Uh, go also over here because maybe somebody can use it for something um these i think i'm going to add with my turquoise and take to have somebody see if they want to purchase them never know turquoise is not diamonds but i tell you what there's not much of it around anymore I'm going to have a couple of colors over in my stuff. So, um, yeah, um, I think it's quite interesting what I found. Some of it was my grandmother's, some of it was my mom's. It's very, very interesting. So, I uh, hope everybody's staying safe. And is healthy and um i hope you all have a blessed day um halloween's coming up i will if my kids are gonna let me well you'll see this afterwards <laughs> so if you like what you see give me a thumbs up if you don't like what you see give me a thumbs down um if you see something you like Give me a holler, you know, we'll fix you up. I'm going to do a video on some things that I am not going to say what they are because I don't want to get in trouble from Facebook, Facebook, YouTube. Um, but I'm going to put them in with some uh, yard sale finds, not yard sale, habitat finds. Found two items and then another, uh, like a screen thing. Well, I'll just tell y'all when <laughs> you see it later. Um, see you later. Y'all have a blessed day.